In Commitment 2020 tonight, many voters are concerned about national security threats, so we asked Republican candidates in the U.S. Senate primary race in New Hampshire what they believe the biggest threat to the U.S. is. Here are their answers. In my opinion, is what we are seeing in what I would like to call American socialism. It is the deterioration of our education system. It is the lack of media telling the truth. It is a narrative that socialism needs to replace our free market system, capitalism, our way of life. Remember, our founding fathers said, and many others said since then, America will perish, not from an enemy without, but from the enemy within. And I believe that with all these things that are going on today, we are getting a glimpse of our future. And we need to do something about it now. And that means getting effective leaders who have an idea about national security, understands the Constitution, understands what that means, our declaration and our values. I think right now the biggest threat is China. Uh, China is determined to be the economic and military leader of the world. And we must hold the Chinese Communist Party accountable for this COVID-19 crisis. Um, we must bring back manufacturing jobs. We must must bring back our abilities to manufacture pharmaceuticals. Uh, we can no longer be the research and development arm for the Chinese Communist Party. They have been stealing their, our intellectual property for a long, long time. We have to stop that. Um, we, we need to recognize that uh, you know, the, the, the students from China that, that come here, we ought to have them come here and study social science, like econ the economics and, and the history of the United States and the Constitution, instead of the hard sciences, which then they take that knowledge back to the Chinese Communist Party. But China is the biggest national security threat.